there's too many athletes, much like, again, Noriega called himself a journalist. Love Noriega. I've met him like, sweet dude, you're not a journalist. Hmm. Sounds like a blatant attack to me. First off, love Noriega, but I'm going to decide to use him as an example because it sucks that I've been doing this way longer than you. And here you are making bank, way bigger bank than me, mind you. But uh, anyway. And I'm not saying that because I have a journalism degree and you don't. It's just not a degree thing. As a journalist, is that part of our jobs and responsibilities is to hold people in power accountable, is to hold, um, is to ask tough questions, is to dig at the truth. All of these things are part of the function and core of journalism. And sometimes, a lot of times, those guys don't really do that. Noriega said his platform was to give artists their flowers. It is not our jobs to give you your flowers. It is our job to put what you're doing in context, to explain it, to corroborate it. Not our job to be your publicist. And I think that's the part that is very different between the function of what some athletes and entertainers do in a media space versus what we do in a media space. So yeah, her degree is what has her bitter. Everything she said a journalist should do, Nori does do. He just include flowers with it. Nori does ask tough questions and he does hold those accountable that he feels deserve it. But because he wants to give people their flowers while they're still here, he's not worthy of journalism. Look, she may have more than likely just watched clips of the show and never saw a full Drink Champs episode. But as someone who was an avid watcher of the show, I always see Nori digging for the truth. Point I'm trying to make here today is, if you love Noriega, you wouldn't have used him as an example, period. That was just some bitter, toxic, jealous energy, man. And you too grown for that. Let's show love and stop hating on people. Peace.